The 1960s were a time of tremendous change in America and in Tennessee. Racial discrimination, a stain on our state and country, needed to be ended in all aspects of life. In education, the policy of segregation, the lie that was separate but equal, was struck down by the Supreme Court in Brown versus Board of Education. But it would take people, communities, and organizations to fulfill the promise to end racial discrimination in public schools. It was time to stand united. In December of 1964, the Tennessee Education Association and the Tennessee Education Congress, the state black teachers organization, began talks on merging the two organizations. Both groups faced some obstacles, as was expected, with a merger and considering the climate in the country. On Sunday, July 10, 1966, the TEA-TEC Joint Committee met at the TEA building to complete and draft the final merger proposal. Leaders of TEA and TEC then went to their assemblies with the proposal. It was a powerful signal to the state that the teachers would be at the forefront of ending racial segregation. TEA members approved the merger on December 10, 1966, and TEC members approved on February 4, 1967. All teachers in the state were finally united. This year marks the 50th anniversary of the merger. Back then, there were special interests and ideologues trying to destroy public education. And the merger was a powerful moment for protecting our students and schools. There are special interests and ideologues today that are trying to destroy public education. And the United TEA is the only organization standing in their way. As we celebrate the proud moment of the merger, we can also celebrate the important role of all of us standing together as the Tennessee Education Association.